Hey guys, Mr. Mom. Happy Memorial Day weekend, people. And I just want to, you know, spend a couple minutes with you here, guys, and show you the reef tank real quick as we get started. Frog spawns, frog spawning. You know, we got the little, the little uh, mushroom. Not mushroom, but uh, toadstool coral. Sorry, guys, I was having a brain freeze there. Toadstool coral. It's looking cool. Green star polyps aren't open right now, but they are starting to spread on that rock. And uh, I don't know, I haven't really added much. I, I'm gonna admit, guys, the reef tank's been kind of pushed to the side because, you know, everything I'm doing with all my planted tanks, which I have tons of. And, uh, but the reef tank, guys, I love it. It's right, it's in my living room, guys. So, you know, it's right here next to the big, big screen and everything, and I stare at this thing all the time. So I try and keep it looking good. And, uh, these Aikens aren't really doing too much. I don't know if it's the right light or something. I mean, they're not dying or nothing. They're just kind of, they're just kind of hanging out, guys. I'm, I'm moving them around and stuff, you know, and letting them sit for a couple weeks. This one's not doing too bad here. I think they might have been getting too much light, if that makes any sense. So, and I did frag these Zoas myself, which, you know, I know it's not a big deal to all you reefer guys, but, uh, to me, it's a big accomplishment. It's my first frag job. I got them actually heads for the most part. They were just like heads or maybe two heads in one little stock, and I did it myself. So big high five to myself, guys. Slapping on the back. So reef tank's looking good, though, people. It just kind of got kicked off to the side and, and kind of ran away with. So um, here's one of the holy tanks, guys, in the fish room. Some Cuba in here. You know, got some giant high grow. I wanted to show you this guy's the uh, temple. I mean, it's really starting to It's really starting to redden up Under decent lighting so you guys that's a real nice plant. but I mean obviously I got a lot of plants guys I mean we sell plants online, so we got to carry a lot of plants. It's like anybody else who sells plants It's got to have stock guys. There's some dwarf hair grass and we got it in the clumps this time guys And I don't know for sure if that's you know, we can get it a lot of different ways obviously um, but we got it in clumps this time just to see, you know, see how it rolls. Um, but it looks good right now, guys. It looks awesome. It looks really good right now. Staying nice and green and everything. So, um, yeah, doing good. Good sting. Let me go around the corner here. It's a bumblebee tank in this room, too. I mean, I, I can't even explain to you how many bumblebees they are. Some people can, but I can't. They're all up in this water lettuce and everything else, guys. Richia moss bush is just getting just getting mass in there. So we're going to be adding shrimp to the site, too, guys, to fire it up aquatics. We'll have shrimp on there. You know, of course, we'll have bumblebees and cherries, and we're going to try and get you some more, guys. But um, I'm just trying to figure out the shipping details and all that as far as the shrimp goes, and we'll have some shrimp rocking in there. You know we're going to bring you some shrimp, guys. You know I'm a shrimp guy. You know I'm a shrimp guy. Another tank here, guys. I got holding tanks. I got a lot of tanks, guys. A lot of holding tanks. You know, I'm just showing you a couple. Some wicked scarlet. Some scarlet temple in there, guys. Scarlet temple. It's a good plant, people. like this plant. You know, like anybody else, guys, we got a variety. You know, we got a variety. We got a store. Look at the blue high grow back there. It's wicked too. You can't really see it that good, guys. I know, but the blue high grow is really nice back there. I'm I'm gonna run some of that in my purse tank and my personal tank, my personal rig. It's getting some of that. My personal rig is gonna get some of the sawtooth high grow. You know, we got some golden ladelia, which you know that that stuff for the, you know for the right kind of scape and stuff, the golden ladelia, you can't really go wrong with that. And then I had a quick question, guys, right before I let you go here on the dwarf baby tears that we're carrying right now. Fired up aquatics, guys, just in case you don't know. Um, carrying mats of dwarf baby tears are coming in this cup. And I don't know if the picture shows it real well that's on the website, but it's about a three by three, maybe a little bit bigger mound, you know, of baby tears and of dwarf baby tears. These guys, you know, they're wicked guys. They're in wicked condition. You know, it's like, it's like a golf green, guys. They're in really good condition. We just leave them in these cups because they stay together better and stuff, guys. And they do really well in these cups. So, um, yeah, dirty tank. We'll talk about that later, guys. So, that's it. Enjoy your Memorial Day, guys. Hang out with your kids. Hang out with your wives for once. You know how it is. J Flush Tanks, Mr. Mom Tanks, FiredUpAquatics.net, guys. Check it out. Put in your pictures.
Peace.